Hi, I'm Steve White from Hawk Company. Today I'll show you how to perform routine cleaning of a differential pH probe. Regular cleaning will ensure measurement accuracy and extend the functional life of your pH probe. You will want to wear rubber gloves and safety glasses as protection from your process. We will cover three solutions, a water rinse, a soap and water solution, and cleaning with a mild acid solution. Any of these can be used to clean your probe, depending on the condition at the time of cleaning. The most common cleaning method uses either tap or deionized water to rinse debris from the probe head. After rinsing, any remaining debris can be wiped off with a soft, clean cloth such as a lab wipe. Be sure to give the probe a final rinse with the DI water to remove any remaining material. For more aggressive cleaning, you can use a mild soap solution. This can be made with either laboratory or common dish soap, but do not use any that contain lanolin. You can soak the probe for several minutes if necessary. More persistent debris can be dislodged using a soft polymer bristle brush, such as a toothbrush. Gently scrub the probe head, being careful not to scratch the glass electrode. After cleaning, give a final rinse with DI water and pat dry with a lab wipe. Even more aggressive cleaning can be done using a dilute HCl solution. Our recommendation is a solution not greater than 5% HCl to water. You can soak the probe in the HCl solution for not more than 5 minutes. Then, rinse the probe with tap or DI water to rinse off any remaining acid solution. If necessary, use soap solution and a soft brush to gently scrub any remaining debris and finally rinse with DI water and pat dry. It is critical to recalibrate your probe after cleaning using a combination of pH 4, 7, or 10 buffer. Hawk recommends cleaning your probe every three months. A more aggressive process may require more frequent cleaning. Regular cleaning and inspection can help ensure measurement accuracy and extends the life of your probe. 